Hello all my nerd friends out there, this is Mr. Chili here, and I'm here to give you guys my review and thoughts on Iron Man, Marvel Legends Iron Man from the Controller Wave. And I'm kind of happy I got this figure. This figure was really cool, unique. I needed Iron Man for myself. Uh, there's so many Iron Mans that Marvel Legends gave it to us, a lot of different ones. But I like this one. This one is pretty cool. It's newer. Uh, I'm not much of a classic Iron Man, so I didn't get the, I think the 20th anniversary or 15th anniversary of uh, Iron Man. Um, I, got, I like this one. It's a more modern day Iron Man suit. I kind of wish it did better on the chest piece, kind of like the little, um, where his heart supposed to be at, the, the uh, circle thing. It's all white. Um, I wish it did better on those part. Uh, made a different color. It kind of looks too stickery. You can tell that's a sticker right in the middle. But uh, to me, that's the only thing problem about this. But um, I wish it gave us a Tony Stark accessory head. I got mine from a past Tony Stark one. I used to, uh, Iron Man I used to have. I think every Iron Man suit should have a Tony Stark accessory. It looks good with the head accessories. Uh, the Tony Stark head accessory. And we got two blast effect, two smoke effects that came with the um, Iron Heart one time. But it's all the simple accessories we get from Iron Man. Um, easy. But pretty cool. Like I said, nothing too special about this Iron Man. If you need Iron Man, I recommend getting this one. It's probably pretty easy. doesn't have a build a figure in it. So you, if you try and build that just the controller, you don't need to pick up this Iron Man if you don't need it. But I'm glad to have it. It's very cool, very unique, very good Iron Man. In my book, I'm happy to have it on my shelf. But I want to hear your guys' thoughts on this Iron Man for the controller wave. What you think about it? You like it or not? Let me know. But I'm also hopefully one day Marvel Legends give us an Iron Patriot. The Norman Osborn Iron Patriot one. I want to build my, I want to finish my this Dark Avenger display. Uh, we already got Sentry coming out. Hopefully, we get some more of the other characters. Um, but the Norman Osborn Iron Patriot is one of my favorite Iron Man suit ones. Hopefully, we get that one these days. Uh, definitely with the Norman Osborn head with it, it'd be pretty cool. Uh, I think it'd be easy for Hasbro to do that. So, hopefully, one day we get this. I hope we get an MCU too, um, Iron Patriot one day. That's a Norman Osborn. That'd be cool. A Dark Avenger buoy. That'd be cool. But we need some more villains for Iron Man as well. Hopefully we get Riplash. A modern day Riplash. I would love to have this Riplash design um, to fight my Iron Man, to put my villain shelf. Pretty cool to get this Riplash around here. Um, there's not that many Iron, Iron Man villains we got. The only one we got is uh, Crimson Dynamo that I know. And that's it mostly. I mean, you could count Ultron, but no Mandarin, no. Um, Madam Mass, uh, there's an old one, but like I said, we need some more Iron Man villains. But comment below what you think of this Iron Man. Do you like it? Do you don't like it? Like to hear your thoughts. But thank you all for watching my videos again. I love talking toys to you all. Please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel, and I'll talk to you all next time. I hope you all have a good day and good night. And remember, stay nerdy forever. Bye.